Sony Handycam HDR XR 160. So let's open this up, shall we? So pretty much this is a uh, HD 1080p camcorder. So here, let me un I'm unboxing this. So we have our CD with the software, some install CDs, manuals, uh, more manuals, paper. It has a 160 gig hard drive, which is one of the selling points that this has. It's a 160 gigs, 56 hours of HD recording. So we have our power charger cable right here. It's for the wall. I'll just set that aside. Um, this will be enough for the charger, the other part of the charger. See, now we got, uh, I think these are composite cables for the camcorder, but you have to buy HDMI separately. Let's see, what is this? This would be your USB. I believe this might this is a USB charger. Not too sure what this is. There is a USB right here. Not too sure. And your battery pack. It's uh, it's not too heavy. It's pretty light actually. It's a really light battery. This and this right here would be the camcorder itself. But before that. There's one more thing in the box, and that is these right here, which I'm totally not sure what are. This actually, I think, is your component cables or composite. And yeah, these would be your composite. I'm pretty sure this is component. It's hard to tell that. Yeah, this is component. Wait, this is composite. This is component. I think. Whatever. That doesn't matter because I know you all want to see the camcorder itself. So let me take this out carefully. Uh, there's some tags, which I don't know what that is. Oh yeah, and the box itself. Just the box. Here, let me keep all this aside so we have room to view the camera. Okay, so this is the camcorder itself. It's it's not too heavy. Uh, it's, well, it's heavier than the other Sony Handycams because it has a hard drive and not flash memory. It's about 15 ounces, almost a pound, but it doesn't feel too bad at all. Uh, so this would be your strap, and with the strap, it's pretty nice. It actually fits really comfortable in the hand. It doesn't seem like it will fall out or anything. It's pretty comfortable. So here are the specs. It's pretty much right here a uh, 3 megapixel still camera and of course 1080p HD video let's open this up right here you have your 3 inch LCD display and it's touch screen like most of the HD cameras today it has all the bells and whistles of the modern camcorders you know autofocus uh, extended zooms this one has a 42x extended zoom plus a 30x extended zoom or 30x optical zoom and a 350x digital zoom. So nice lens. This is their. This is Sony's uh, wide G angle or wide angle G lens. It's one of their newer ones. You have your speakers right here. Let's open this up. This is your HDMI output or or input. So if you want to, this is a nice feature because if you want to connect to the TV or your monitor without having to uh, copy this stuff on your computer or a external this is nice because you can just view it immediately without copying here's a mic to plug in any external mics and the HDMI is sold separately power button play button let's see if this will turn on oh, I have to put the battery I'll do that in a sec so your zoom uh, uh, photo modes or photo and then different modes you can use through that this would be where you plug in uh, the cables these cables and your record button so let me plug in this battery and we'll turn it on I'm really excited to use this because now from now on I'll be using this in my videos so we'll have 1080p quality Plugged in the battery, now let's turn it on. 
Sorry if the uh, thing, the camera gets off, ca uh, my hands and stuff get off camera because it's hard to uh, look at the camera and make the review or unbox. Just saying, if that makes any sense to you. Okay, so, let's see, language settings. So, English, of course. I clicked it. Oh, next. I guess this is their setup. Yep, next, time zones, whatever. Daylight saving times, sure. Okay, on. It's pretty much just setup. It's a date and time. Um, month. Yeah, sure, okay. I don't care. Okay, next. What is this? Oh, the okay, I'll do that later. Because let's just get to the actual thing itself. New York, blah, 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 blah. I don't even live in New York. That's the time zone. So a lens is an auto close, pretty much. So when you uh, turn this on, it opens by itself. And when you close it or you start just watching stuff on it, it closes automatically, which is a nice feature. Instead of having those caps or anything. Or if you, you don't, you won't forget to actually close it. So here's the video right here. And I'll shut off the camera that I'm using now. As you see it closed. And I will show you the quality of this. Here's some test video with the Sandy Sony Handycam. Just viewing the streets. And here's some long distance. This is the zoom, testing out the zoom. Up to about right here is the optical zoom. So we're seeing pretty far. Yeah. So that's optical zoom. And then it goes to digital. This is all digital. So it's, even at this distance, the quality is pretty good still. Here we have some close-up shots of this flower. Took a little bit of time to focus though, but I got it now. Sorry if my hands are a bit shaky, but the tripod this would be really good.